If you read the Old Testament, they used to prophesy by encounters. You know? Encounters they had with the Holy Ghost. Listen. The Holy Ghost will come on them. In other words, the Holy Ghost will come on them and inspire their speaking. So the inspiration was never with them. In the Old Testament. The Holy Ghost will come on them and inspire their speaking. So they didn't own the inspiration. The inspiration always came to them. At moments when it was needed. Then you will find them say, The Spirit of the Lord God came upon me. The Spirit of the Lord God was upon me. The hand of the Lord came upon me. You find this, the word... The spirit coming on is not in the epistles. You will not find that. The spirit coming on or the spirit came on Peter or the spirit came upon Paul. No, you won't find that, that phrase in the epistles. The spirit does not come on you today for you to function in the gifts of the spirit. In the New Testament, he calls prophecy a gift of the spirit you don't wait for the spirit to come he already lives in you so you carry the inspiration with you and you use it at will he doesn't come come holy spirit i need you get born again oh your strength and your power get born again Come in your own special way. How special? He's not coming. He came. And he will never leave. Glory to God. Are you still here? If you're here, can I have a good amen? amen. Say with me, the spirit lives in me. Amen. amen. An endowment. That's what you have. The word charisma. In the Greek is similar to an ability. Charisma. Something that is now a part of you. Because in Joel's prophecy said, his prophecy said, and they shall prophesy. Who shall prophesy? They. Who shall prophesy? You. And they say I shall prophesy. Say I prophesy. Say I will prophesy. Say I will always prophesy. You don't have to wait for the spirit to come. The spirit lives in you. So you can prophesy at will. I will prophesy. I will sing in the spirit. I will sing with my understanding. Amen. They shall prophesy. That means the people to whom God gave the spirit will have the ability to prophesy. So don't receive, you don't receive inspiration from heaven to prophesy. You have been given utterance. That utterance is the ability you have already. Somebody shout, I have utterance. In the Holy Ghost. Right now. Say it again, I have utterance. In the Holy Ghost. Right now. Say it again, I have utterance. In the Holy Spirit. Right now. I didn't have a good amen. You have utterance. You have utterance. You have the door to speak already. You have the door to speak already. You don't wait. And then when the atmosphere is conducive, let us charge the atmosphere so that the spirit of prophecy can come. The Holy Ghost fire is moving just like a magnet. Mm. The Holy Ghost power is moving just like a magnet. Mm. Moving here, moving here, like in the days of Pentecost. The Holy Ghost power is moving like, oh yes, I'm feeling it. It's coming now. Again. No. No. He lives in you. Glory to God. 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 Say, I don't need an atmosphere. I am the atmosphere. Oh, I tell you, I tell you, I tell you. Somebody say, you know, let, let, let's create an atmosphere. No, once I enter a place, the atmosphere is created. See, I carry my atmosphere. 
Anywhere I enter, the atmosphere is created. I prophesy at will. Makota Balada. Hey, Zabuda Gayana. Egebo Jakaya. Lekota Nama. Egebo Rata. Egele Boja. Egebo Lata. You can stop somebody on the road and tell him, Thus saith the Lord. On the road. It's a day for madmen. Stop him on the road. Say, I hear the Spirit of God. Say, I should tell you. When you were leaving your house this morning, there was a lot of confusion in the family. And even as you're walking on the road right now, you're full of heaviness in your heart. But I hear the Spirit of God say, I should tell you, who, I'm, I'm, the man will stand there. And after you finish, you will be born again. And after born again, you will receive the Holy Ghost. And after Holy Ghost, he will prophesy there with you. Because the moment you come into a company of prophets, you shall prophesy with them. You know, we can come for a service, prophecy service. So today we're going to have a prophecy service. Everybody, let's gather there. So everybody coming there is coming with what? With prophecy. Just like we have prayer meeting, we can have prophecy meeting. Because both prayer and prophecy is at will. I don't know if I'm teaching here. You don't need a special. He, he, he's like cold water. Ice blocks are falling from heaven. Say the Lord, say the Lord, say the Lord, say the Lord. Say the Lord. No, no. You know, many people think the spirit will talk for them. So they are not in control. I am the Lord. I am the Lord. I am the Lord. I am among you. 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 I will be with you. I will be with you. Fear not, fear not, fear not. Because in their mind, there's a spirit talking. Stop that, my friend. You are the one who speaks at will. I will. Not he will, I will. He says, they shall prophesy. I put my spirit upon all flesh. Your sons and daughters, they shall prophesy. Who shall prophesy? Say, I. That's right. Say, I prophesy. Say it again. I prophesy. Say it one more time. I prophesy. prophesy. Say that. Let me round up this service. Are you enjoying this? At salvation, you have already received the spirit. That is sorted. So prophecy or prophesying is now a function of the supernatural ability that has been given to you by God already. Is, is a function of that same ability that got you born again, which is already residential inside you. It's not going to come. Open the floodgates of heaven. Let it rain. Let it rain. Dun, 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 dun. You are just entertaining yourself. There's no floodgate anywhere. There's no window of heaven to be opened. You are not under heaven. You are in heaven. So you don't need windows to be open. It's only a man under that needs windows to be open. It's only a man under that needs rain. I don't need rain. I am right there. I am the rainmaker. Yeah, I am the rainmaker. Once you start speaking, what are you making? You are making rain. The floods are flowing. The rain is falling. The moment you start speaking in tongues. This is the refreshing. This is the refreshing. What is the refreshing? When you start speaking in tongues. Rain is not coming from anywhere. He said, shall be in you. He shall be in you. Where is he? In you. And the ability is available to you to use at will. If I'm teaching good, say, I hear you. Say, I have the ability. Say, I have supernatural endowment. Say, I have supernatural ability to function supernaturally. In other words, you are supernaturally enabled to prophesy. 
Say again with me. I am supernaturally enabled to prophesy. So prophesying, say with me, prophesying is an ability I have in Christ. Say it again. Prophesying is an ability I have in Christ. Today, I acknowledge it and I will prophesy non-stop. Non-stop. It's a super, I have it. Whatever is yours, you use when you need it. Uh -uh. Amen. 